um, from what the flyer I gave to him said, he spends a lot of money getting to and from work. I feel bad for Batane because he he's an artist. He does not want to do any of this shit. But it's kind of like he feels like he has to work because he needs to make money. He's not making any money off of his music, so. Um. Let's see, every morning they do the uh, an exercise. X triangle O X. So, let's keep that in mind. Hopefully I won't forget immediately. There goes Batayan up there. <laughs> yes, we've seen this before. So, she's gonna get all excited because we have our manager pass. Again, like I mentioned last time, the manager for a day is not actually for a day, it's indefinite so you can come back as many days as you want all right in we go So you notice that these workers all have the same face as the Scarecrow did, so... Um, I think Kate Gummy mentioned in the chat before, last time I did a stream, that it was... It seems like it's sort of a uh, commentary on Japanese um, factory... Um, you know, the life of a Japanese factory worker. Probably a lot like an American factory worker, too. I don't know. I don't work at a factory, so I can't say. <laughs> Whatever you say, buddy. <laughs> Alright, so... We've seen this tour before, if you've been in another one of these streams. So what we're going to do is we are going to try and slam talk to everybody and find the person who will tell us that the security guard is lazy. Hmm, time to do our dance. Hopefully I remember it. Or I could just do it completely wrong on purpose, but I kind of need to save the, uh... Ah, oh, fuck it, who cares. Let's do it wrong. Wee! I am graceful. I did it right. I'm a manager. Oof. Fourteen hearts, damn. Alright, so time to rush around as quick as possible. You only have a certain amount of time before they kick you into the next factory. So... That's the guy who sent the uh, letter to the Scarecrow, by the way. Let's find the security guy. 
There's a security guard over to the right, and in each section of the factory, there's at least one time where a security guard is lazy. And if that happens, we can hide and wait until night. That's the only time we'll be able to be to use the uh, tram to be able to get to the safe. You. Someone, tell me that security guard's lazy. So pretty much all these employees have the same sort of um, belief system that, hey, you know, they're going to try and work really hard and get promoted. And everybody is a manager of something. So my being manager for the day is really not all that special. That's where I would hide, but it does not seem like the security guard in this section is lazy. How about you? Did I talk to you? No. Alright. Nobody in this section. So basically, we have to wait until whatever time our uh, chief tells us it's time to go check the next section of the factory. Yep. So, like we saw last time we went to the factory, all of these factories are in Mobius Strip. The factory we just visited is making a factory. This one is making parts for a new factory, and the factory we're going to visit is, uh... I don't fucking remember, it's dumb. Ba basically, all the factories are just making new factories. That's like their whole goal. Supposedly, they also make funny cola, too. Which is a delicious beverage. Do you guys know if security guard's lazy or not? This is the uh, section where Batayan is working, as we'll see. Uh, did I talk to you? Pretty sure I did, but whatever. Yep, yep, yep. Come on. Alright, so hopefully someone in here will be, uh, useful. Can't imagine you don't like your work environment. You've had like two hours of sleep. All right. So again, nobody at this factory thinks that our security guard's lazy either. 
which is about what happened last time. I think it's random, but... Last time I did this, I talked to the person, and right as I was talking to him, it was time to go to the next factory. Oh, this guy mentions that the former manager of the safe um, went to go work on a farm or something. He's the guy we, uh, he's the scarecrow, basically. Hey, buddy. You see there are holes dotted around here for uh, there's a couple underground residents. But we can't reach them. We're not going to be able to reach them this this go through the factory anyway, so there's no point in showing them off. Alright, so, like I said, I'm pretty sure this factory is the one that has the um... Lazy security guard. So let's quick look around. Up, up, hey. There we go. This security guard is lazy. Now it doesn't matter what everyone else says. Let's get over here and hide. Security guard is not lazy. He will um, be able to find you no matter where you hide. All the factory workers will shuffle out. That's security guard's turn to um, finally walk around. He'll peek around the areas. Make sure everything's good. I don't remember that sound effect. Okay. Gotta shine a spotlight on the work he did. Alright. Terrific. Good to go. Alright, we are now in the factory. And again, because I'm streaming, I'm gonna save it so I don't fuck everything up horribly. And first thing we're gonna do is check the stall. Delicious. So that guy just dropped a golden nugget, which we will send to Lost and Found. 
so there is no time to waste. So what?